His former owner was sentenced in Schenectady County earlier this week to a year behind bars for abusing his Great Dane named Oliver. The dog who had his mouth taped shut while his owner beat him bloody is recovering in Fulton County. Our Mars in town paid Oliver a visit today as he adjusts to his new life abuse-free. They all have a story and a name, but this dog holds a special place in Eric Bellow's heart. Meet Oliver the Great Dane. Dogs like him that can let go of the past, they, they, they do have, you know, they, they take a big piece of my heart. Oliver has been recovering at Pack Ethic, a dog rescue and rehabilitation facility in Sprakers for the last two months. His previous owner, Michael Perillo, was sentenced this week to a year in jail for duct taping his mouth shut while he brutally beat him. Ever since the first day that I met him, good boy, um, Oliver has been a big teddy bear. It's, it's all mentally with him. His physical um, trauma was healed a long time ago, um, but what, what stayed mentally was the insecurity with other humans, um, insecurity with other surroundings. Part of the rehabilitation of Oliver is assimilating him with new people, and the best way to do that is to introduce yourself with a treat. You want to keep everything nice and simple and, and relaxed. And what that does is it teaches Oliver that humans aren't here to hurt him. Humans are here to be his friends. But for now, it seems Oliver prefers his four-legged friends, no matter their size or speed. But there's nothing else in the world than taking a dog and giving them um, safety and, and showing them that, you know, they can let go of the past. And what they give you back is, is you know, is out of this world. Marcy Natal, CBS 6 News, Spreakers. Glad to see him doing so well. The goal of Pack Ethic is to someday find a forever home for Oliver, but they say that's up to Oliver. If he doesn't, he will always have a home with them in Sprakers.